Hey, it's just so Trish, and I just wanted to do a quick video for any of y'all that with the hurricane coming through and you're having um, to prepare for your insurance claims, inventory, inventory, inventory. And I want to talk about how I'm getting my inventory done today. Um, so in the panic, in the rush, everything was thrown out front. And then I'm kind of showing you, then the garbage bags are piled up here. Well, waiting for the insurance adjuster and the insurance company told me I have to inventory what is in there if I want to claim it. <clears throat> Overwhelming task, I know. So one of the things I want to talk about is the actual like logistics of what I'm already finding to be quick and easy to get this done. <clears throat> Google Drive. If you're set up with Google, with a Gmail account, you have Google Drive. And the Google Drive yeah, that was the driveway we lost. <coughs> the county finally got it back together. The Google, Google Drive account will um, let you actually take pictures and load them directly into Google Drive so you're not um, filling your space up on your phone. And then you can begin typing it up. So yeah, you gotta have a smartphone or a tablet. But it's nice to know that like my husband can be adding to that Google Drive at the same time. And so you can do dual processes. So um, go to Google Drive, open up a folder, just type in your, ins I mean, I just put in insurance loss, my insurance inventory. And then right in that spot, I'm doing photos. So I have one Google document for all of my furniture I've lost. I have another document that I'm just calling my trash bag loss. So what are in the trash bags? Now I have to go and open up all my trash bags. The other part is I can scan and take photos. Now you might find that Google Drive will edit your photos before you accept the photo. You can go in there and <clears throat> select cropping because it might already crop for you so you can go and move your points where you want it to get that picture. And then um, it'll even do your colors for you. Sorry, it's a rough morning. <clears throat> I already burnt my breakfast um, to do. So... <coughs> <laughs> that's the other aspect the next aspect I have to do mine in the yard because there's just no room in the house it's already out of the house I don't want to deal with it so one of the things I've done is here's my setup for my doing my inventory I have one trash bag to start with I have um, I actually have a plastic liner and then I put a waterproof um, tablecloth on top so I can dump my garbage, I can scoop it back up and put it back in. So my method is I'm going to dump my garbage, I'm going to quickly go through it, what I'm inventorying. I might just take a blank picture, a first picture, just in case later on I go, I'm like, there's that, I need to inventory that. Um, and then I'm going to set the things aside, take a picture, and then as I do that, I am putting it into um, my Google Drive document. So I think that this might be the easiest way so that you're not writing on notebook paper and then you can't figure out where you put the notebook paper. Then you have to type it up. It's already begun. So this is my disaster, um, not relief, but my disaster <laughs> ever. Since <clears throat> I'm feeling blessed that God has given me the clear with all and a couple days advance on the rest of you that are going through this because of Hurricane Matthew. There you go. So I'll probably have more tips on how to deal with your disaster um, coming up as I go through. But I thought this was a good tip. Definitely, you know, get access to your Google Drive. I think this is going to make a world of difference. You can give the people that you need to access to it so they can be adding to it. So I have friends coming and I'm going to give them access to my Google Drive. So they will be taking pictures and they will be logging in inventory as we go. And all of us could be doing it at one time in the same place. <clears throat> so I will talk to you later. We are doing well. It's just a lot of work. I'll probably show you the inside of the house later. But as for now, I'm working in the front yard. Excuse my kind of thrown togetherness. I feel like the lack of sleep this last week and a half has aged me greatly. So I'm hoping once this is all over, a good sense of intense moisturizer and a good couple days worth of sleep, I will look a little bit more youthful. So I will talk to you later. Peace out.